That's cute. Made me uncomfortable. Just girly things. I just like need to take a nap. I don't know how to get them out. <laughs> yeah. Good morning, welcome to the vlog. We are under the weather this week. That's what's going on. It's Tuesday. Yesterday I did nothing but sit on the couch and feel terrible. And I'm feeling a little bit better today. It's like a little bit. I think I caught mine before it got too bad and I was able to take like wellness shots and vitamin C and that maybe, maybe, maybe it's placebo effect. I don't know. Doing a whole lot better than my husband. <laughs> so, and it's not COVID, it's not the flu. I'm pretty sure it's literally just a cold, which is so annoying. Colds are so annoying. I did not go grocery shopping yesterday because one, we have tons of leftovers because my sister came this weekend and we ate out and it was, I mean like it was so delicious, but my body feels so bad. I need to go to the grocery store today, but this week's groceries look a little bit different because all we really want is like soup and fruit. So I'm going to Whole Foods this week to get fruit, some broth, and I think I also need to run to Costco or Sam's to get a chicken. And Boomer is also out of dental bones, so. Okay, lighting strip. I got some stuff at Whole Foods and then I left the parking lot very quickly because there was a man watching me and it made me uncomfortable, just girly things. But there's actually a brand new Trader Joe's over in this area. So I'm gonna go there because I didn't want to pay seven dollars for broccoli like Whole Foods wanted me to And so I'm outside of that and we're gonna go and we're gonna check out the new the new stuff Okay, I'm finally home. It's like 1140. I did not mean to be gone that long it's just nothing in Connecticut is convenient. Nothing super far from each other, but nothing that you want is like right next to each other. And that's like really annoying, but that's fine. Got everything I need for the week. Hopefully it'll be a good week. We're gonna, oh, I have a hair appointment this week. I'm so excited. I've like been feeling really bad about myself and I was like, oh, I should dye my hair because if I dye my hair blonde, it just makes everything better. So I'm doing that on Thursday. So it's like a little glow up with me week because I'm very, very excited. So I'm gonna take all the groceries in. I'm gonna drink some water. We're gonna eat some food. It's gonna be great. <laughs> have gone so downhill since yesterday. I feel 
so bad and I'm about a day or two behind symptoms wise my husband so he feels like great today like good for him but I feel so bad my least favorite part of colds or allergies or whatever is the nasal congestion and that's like all i have today and it's driving me insane and it's also i felt so bad for so many days and we had guests before that that so many things were piling up so i'm actually having to do things today because i didn't really do much the first two days and so i've been doing laundry and cleaning up the living room and organizing the costco cabinet and i'm just so over it but like this stuff needs to get done and i know for a fact if i just leave it all there for helping me i'm gonna be so pissed off at myself that's what's going on it's like three o'clock and i really i I'm... last night i made some soup that was such a huge batch that like i'm not even joking we're gonna be eating on for like two or three days so that's at least good because at least cooking's done don't have to worry about that because i don't like pre-made soups because i don't like onions and i swear to god onions are in everything and i don't like onions so i have to make my own soups and i'm just at least that's done so that's what's going on really looking forward to tomorrow i swear to god this week was literally supposed to be like getting my glow up because like the winter blues are setting in and no i like I am sick. So like, yeah, I'm gonna get my hair done, but I'm still gonna feel like absolute shit. There we go. It is just a cold though, so that's the good news. Yeah, that's my third, it's Wednesday. It's Wednesday, I swear to God. I just like need to take a nap. Like I'm not, okay. Just wanna check in and let you know how it's going because it's going really poorly. And also I was watching a whole bunch of TikToks about lucky girl syndrome. And if anyone knows how to turn this into a lucky girl syndrome, Thing, let me know because my brain is blank like I cannot think of a way to spin this positively so okay bye <laughs> okay I'm going to get my hair done today so I thought I would do a little get ready with me so this is primer I'm getting my hair dyed blonde if you can see there's some blonde in there. I love dyeing my hair blonde. I've been doing it for years. I have not done it since September and the winter blues have really, like really been affecting me. So I was like, oh my God, you know what would fix that? Dyeing your hair. This is only the second winter that I have lived in the Northeast. I'm originally from Texas. So I'm not used to this much winter usually if it's cold <laughs> it'll be warm the next week so this is still a learning experience for me and i'm dealing with winter blues and of course the one week that i'm like i'm gonna take care of it i get a cold so glowing up is really hard <laughs> so i'm going pretty blonde last time i didn't like fully articulate what i wanted and it was still cute like she still did a good job but it just wasn't as bright as i typically get it because she was the is the first time i went to her and so this time i am fully prepared to like show her pictures of exactly what i want so i want it to be really really bright almost like a summer blonde because i am really struggling out here with winter i really i do not understand how people deal with this it's so annoying but i'm loaded up on medication today <laughs> i always put on mascara first because for some reason i am just like the worst person at putting it on and we get so messy oh my god so i'm going pretty light on the makeup today i just wanted to like make myself feel good about myself because i have been feeling so bad <laughs> i like honestly don't even know what i'm doing half the time i'm still using like bethany modus tips from when i watched when i was 14 and like i'm okay with that but i feel like at some point i'm gonna have to learn new techniques but not today that's for sure when i tell you i've been doing the exact same eye makeup for eight years i'm not even joking with you and i still get compliments on it to this day so like why would i stop if i'm still getting compliments and i swear to god it's like the most basic thing ever 
but for some reason it really it just it holds up you know she's like a like a staple because like people still like it capsule is that the word And there you go. A 10 minute quick makeup routine for whenever you're feeling really, really bad. Okay, I still have an hour and a half, but I need to eat. So, this is my outfit. Jeans are made well. My top is thrifted, but it's from Eddie Bauer. My necklace is from Etsy. Yeah, that's the fit. Okay, I'm outside the salon. Last looks. I always. I always, ha my hair is always in like the worst condition possible whenever I bring it to get done, but that's just, that's just how it is. Okay, so we're gonna go in, we're gonna be there. I swear to God. You know what, I'm just gonna leave. I'm just gonna, okay, bye. Okay, here it is. It is not as honey and golden as I asked for, and that that's the same thing that happened last time too, so. We're gonna have to work on our communication, but I still think it looks good. Very bright. I think it'll definitely get me out of my winter slump. Uh, my body is feeling so many things right now. So many things. One, I feel like incredibly sick to my stomach, and I don't know if that's because I have so many medications in my system <laughs> that I'm feeling sick. I also feel like I'm going to pass out from hunger, which makes no sense because I literally ate before I left and it's only been three hours, so I shouldn't be feeling like that. So my body's feeling a whole bunch of different things and I need to go home and I need to take care of that because we are struggling out here and I don't know why, but. Cute, okay. I'm gonna drive home now.